the only parachute. No to the right. Uh, CCI standard ammo. So it's uh, subsonic. Probably, probably going to have a ceasefire soon because we need to set up targets. It's fine with me, guy. I can take my target. Maybe I should have done it. Five yards, zero in. Two more, two more I need to replace these little springs on these magazines because stock ones are a little wobbly, causing feed issues. There you go. Good group though. Yeah, it was a dead center bullseye there. Less than a one inch group here. I'm blowing a pretty decent sized hole in the paper.
Did you see the back side of those? Yeah. <laughs> You're going to have to be firing something pretty wicked. Here. Not only something to get it through the steel, but it's going to deform it more through the wood before it hits the steel. <laughs> down here for the pistol. A guy I watch calls that the ultimate truck. Just wait till you actually get the.
We got the holes patched up. <laughs> Center target. Try to get the bulls out here. So, we need to go down a couple chicks and Keeping track of the rounds of firing. Thank you. 
Time is it? I have to pay attention to time because of uh, to check the time real quick. Start getting ready to leave around 11:30, 11:45. I have, a, I have a church thing to go to, and I got a bunch of trains packed up in my car for that. So I need to mark down that I fired three more ten. Keeping track of the spin. All right. Um, let's get this. My little empty chamber indicator indicates that nothing in the gun. Wesson MP 15 Sport 2. AR 15. See now. I have one more magazine of this. Hey, it don't tread on it. Awkward angle. Put that there. Safety off, and I don't have the optic on. There we go. Use the, let's use the green dot. Helps if I have a round in the chamber. Are shooting Russian stuff? Nope, I'm shooting American ammo. I shot up
Not in the mag one. It's on the ground. That's your son. Let's load up with some ammo. We've got a lot of shot pieces going up here on the uh, on the uh, table here. One of the things you have to do is clean up after. Um, so easy. Reload these because. They're convenient for measuring them out rounds you want to take out. Take a look. Those mags that are using on the AR, those are the standard capacity uh, 30 rounders. The media loves calling them high capacity. We'll just have to grab that. This is what you go out and you're going to get ground and over and stuff like that. But they're a really tight pattern. Really tight pattern. Yeah. So we got one of them. And one of these max is going to have one short. I think we could probably put one or two there. I don't like just drop another one. Yeah, I know. I Pick up the drop. So you can use rifle out there. So my 270. Okay. And we got nine. Let me uh. I know. I know. Got my ammo case here and grab something out of here. Let's do a. Brother just wanted to come across both. It's their first time out. Yeah. They're, they're enjoying it. Good, good. That's all that matters. Absolutely. Well, hey. Uh, I know. Great. Keep it up. That is my magazine. Like I am um, wagon. I have a little wagon. That I yeah. Yeah. Use too. And just use, you know. I just started talking a couple years ago. Oh, wait, they're all loaded. I got the last year. I was sure. The biggest year I ever gotten in my life. Now I got to learn, I got to learn the public land up here. Finding private land, it's hard. It is very hard. You guys probably get Pack up and ready to go to church. I'm not going to stop on the way home. I'm just going to. Uh, it helps to take this. Alright, take this out. Toss that in. Bottom. 
I can see him when I hit with the AR. straight down one. At first I didn't understand why, but then it's much it's just much easier transitioning between the bolt and and so and the trigger, which means which makes sense, so I probably will be replacing the uh, pistol grip on this thing with a straight down pistol grip. This should be an inexpensive way. Maybe twenty-five dollars maybe. Perfect. Let's just see if I'm shooting this squirrel. It's having a bad day. You could go hunting with this thing, but it's kind of heavy. Just for fun, let's take the uh, suppressor off and uh, I'll show you how loud the standard velocity is without the suppressor. It's not going to have it above the sound track, but it's still going to be much louder than. Okay, I'm going to do upper left target. Safety, my safety was safety was uh, safety was on. <laughs> That's what it went click. Upper upper right target, I think. Upper right. You just set somebody's alarm off. I think that was your alarm. <laughs> Well, that's annoying. Ugh. All right, where were we? Top left. I think I might be offering a top right. Where am I? 
Glasses are causing some issues here. So that's the end of velocity. Unsurprised. As you see, it isn't very loud. It doesn't have the the crack from going above the speed of sound. They bring the supersonics. Check. Um, ammo case. Uh. I did. Okay. Good. Put some of these, uh, put some of these, uh, super sonics into here so you can see the difference. These are Remington Thunderbolts. So let's do five unsilence and five silence. So these are supersonics. Uh, these are moving a hundred something per second. Box as we say. Sure there is. Box. This one's cool. Yeah, you want Five. Gun is clear. That's the rough. That's what I shot with your gun. You want to shoot right where I'm at? Yeah, I'll tell you what. There's nothing cooler than screwing on a suppressor at the end of your uh, firing. <laughs> There's two five rounds. Five rounds. Crest. Super shot. You're still going to have crack. Standard velocities. So in my car, I have my New York Central 2020 limited set. I have my, my Pennsylvania Broadway limited set. I have um, some freight cars. I have the daylight set. Um, 
So I'm going to be sitting that up in the Hillsdale Church where the kids play with. And I'm out of charge, so I'm just going to shoot to the middle, middle of the left side. where I wanted to hit. Where is it? Actually quite a couple. Same hole over and over again. Makes a bigger hole. Yeah, I'm off to the Much done for the day. It's pretty much time to pack up. I got here just a little after. Okay, so when I pack up, I just I throw everything and I clean up later. So, um. Where are you going? One, two, three, four. Oops. One, two, three, four. Okay, so according to the math, let's do some math here. Uh, you have to. Ten rounders, uh, thirteen. Thirteen ten rounders. So that's that where you're at? Ten times thirteen would be one hundred and thirty. Plus a fifteen round, that would be one hundred and forty-five uh, of twenty-two, and um, fifteen thirty thirty-three to so ninety one twenty. 20 plus um, 30 plus 150, 150 rounds of 223. Yeah. No, that's not right. That's not right. My math is off. 20 plus 15 is 5. 135. Of uh, two digits, 135 plus 145, 1, 8, 280 rounds that I shot off today. Which is about what half I usually do at the range is uh, 200. Alright, well, time to pack up and clean up. <clears throat>